Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So first of all, I wanna thank you guys all so much for helping me get to 1,000 subscribers. I am blown away and I am just so thankful for all of you. So thank you so much, but I won't dawdle on. So recently I got my community tab, all because of you guys. And I recently put up a poll on my community tab saying I had two videos that I wanted to plan to film this weekend. Um, but which one should I upload first? And the first one to be chosen to be uploaded was my photo card binder tour. So I haven't done a photo card binder tour in a long time. There have been many changes in my binders. Um, this is kind of my end of the year 2019 photo card binder tour. I think I'm gonna start with my Fromis binder, just cause I haven't honestly looked in here in a long time which makes me kind of sad. So yes, there's really not been much change to like the design of my binder, which I am probably going to change in 2020. Yeah, there's nothing on the back. On the inside, I don't think there has been much change just because, just because, you know, Fromis haven't had a comeback in around seven months and uh, off the record, what are you doing? <laughs> like, why are you taking so long? But anyway, um, we'll go ahead and get into it. So, all right, so this first page is um, a little brochure that I broke into two pages. I got this from KCON LA 2018, and it just has some information about the members, um, if you didn't already know about them. But we will go ahead and get into the photo cards. So I do collect OT9 for all album releases. So I do have the treasured to heart page. Um, these are the Polaroids from the Blue album and this took me so long to complete that I am just so freaking happy that it's all done. Um, and then we have this page. This is also to heart. These are the Blue album um, photo cards. So there's not much to say. They're not really photo cards. They're more like school ID photos, but they're still super duper cute. Then we also move into the two-day album. These are the D-1 version photo cards. As I've said in all my previous photo card videos, I don't collect the bookmarks just because I think it's kind of a waste of money um, to like go out and buy all of them. So I just keep the one that I pulled. And Yuri was not in this comeback because she was in Produce um, 48. So that is why there's only eight members. Same with this set. Um, these are the D-Day versions. This is honestly one of my favorite Fromis photo card sets. I just love them so much. And then we move into From Nine, which is the album Love Bomb is on. So we have, I believe these are the pink backs and these are the purple back photo cards. This is absolutely one of my favorites. She's so stunning, like, oh my goodness. And these are the Kino cards. They started doing Kinos for From Nine. So these are the photo cards you got in the Kino. Then we move on to the monstrosity that was Fun Factory. The, um, you know, four sets of photo cards in one album. So we have the first set of orange backs. These are the ones with the signatures. And these are the ones with the messages from the girls. These photo cards are the first set of the pink backed um, ones. And then these are the other set of the pink back photo cards. And then these are the first Kino cards. So this is the fun version of the Kino cards. And then this is the factory version of the Kino cards. And then we move into the Japanese um, pop-up store event um, photo cards. They honestly, I don't know why I got these. <laughs> they're super similar to the Kino cards, but they're super cute anyway, especially just just why did I do this? These were given out to people who actually went to the meet and greet for Fromis. 
so I was like obviously I need to have them even though they're the exact same as these ones so call me dumb but I did it so I already have them this is my page of group cards I collect group cards if I go to like KCON um, or just the Kino albums come with group cards. So I have this page. This one I want to save to get like another KCON card, so like a Japanese one. I've never been able to find a good priced KCON Japan photo card. So I'm looking, I'm looking to complete this page. And then we move into my Jihan broadcast photo cards. So I do collect her for all special photo cards. So this is her glass shoes broadcast card, and if you scan the little QR code, it actually takes you to the music video. This is actually from the debut showcase. I actually don't have the two heart broadcast card. That's the only one I'm missing. Um, and then we have we the um, Dugan Dugan broadcast card is actually bigger, so it's in another part of my binder. So we move into Love Bomb. This is the first broadcast, the second broadcast, and then the fan sign photo card. And then we move into Fun Factory, so we have first broadcast, second broadcast, fan sign card, and then the broadcast card for Love Rum Pum Pum, because they promoted that a few weeks after. And then we move into my even more special Jihan photo cards. So um, these are called the Promise Event photo cards. They had, um, before they even did uh, fan signs for Two Day and Two um, Heart, they did events called uh, promise events where it was basically you got to see all the members I don't know exactly what they did but they gave out photo cards to each person and they would meet the, the fans and like I think they would do pinky promises with them because I know they were called yaksoke which it translates to promise <laughs> sorry for me butchering that um, translation but yeah so I only have seven of them these two are from Two Heart, and these five are from Two Day. There's seven per set, so I am looking to finish these sets in 2020, um, but this is what I have so far. We move into, these are the showcase, like, postcard sets from uh, Two Day, so Dugan Dugan. This is absolutely one of my favorite sets. I love them so much. This is my favorite Jihan look, so yes, I have that set. Again, Yuri was not in that one. Then we have the full set of um, the invitations from from Nine. Um, we have the full set, and then this is the Jihan broadcast card from Dugan Dugan. Then we have this from the pop-up store and my stickers from the albums. And then again, I don't collect the standees, so I just have who I pulled in my original albums, and then I have Jihun's on display. And finally, these are some fansite photo cards. So um, these are from Honey Pow, and then these are from a friend who made his own little slogans, and I made this. So that is the end of my Fromis binder. Hopefully, They'll have a comeback soon in 2019, but the way that all the Mnet drama is happening with Produce, it's probably going to affect Idol School, and yeah, so just please, I don't pray, but like pray for Fromis, like I need to come back real soon, I really miss my girls. So that is my Fromis binder, we'll go ahead and move on to my 17 binder. So this is my 17 binder. I know you guys just like recently saw me putting all my 17 photo cards away, but this is going to be a real flip through of it. So I'll go ahead and get into it. I want to change this binder too in the new year. All right, so when we begin, we start with Jong-un. So I have my collection in alphabetical order, um, kind of. So like Jong-un goes before June, um, and those are the only two members that I collect fully. Um, so yes, we have all of his album cards, so I'll just do a quick flip through. I don't think I need to tell you exactly which cards go to which album. Um, this is actually not an album photo card. I got this from Carrot Land 2018, I believe. Um, but yeah, and then we have all of these ones. And the You Made My Dawn set. 
So we have all of the N Ode cards. And all of the N Ode stickers. And then this is like the little transition between Jungan and June. So his love and letter and his love and letter. Then we move into June. So we have it set up in the same exact way. This is like absolutely one of my favorite pages. It's so pretty. This is a Japanese photo card I pulled, so I just put it there. Then we move into an ode for June. And all of his stickers as well. These I like Impulse bought um, when the Haru Tour came out. So most of these are from Haru Tour and this is from Ideal Cut. Um, I just impulse bought these and I don't think I'll do that again. Then we move into all the lenticulars. So I have every single set complete. I'll move this over so you can see them. Sorry for the glare. I say that in every single freaking video, but sorry for the glare. And then these are the behind the scenes cards. And then we move into mini posters. So these are all the mini posters from an ode. It's so hard to show them. I'm trying. <laughs> so we have all of them. And then we have Jong-un's um, director's cut uh, postcard set with the weird one on the back. And uh, we have June's Director's Cut postcard set with the one on the back. We have the AL1 postcards, and then I actually pulled this from my We Make You album uh, as the pre-order gift, so I just put it there. And then I do collect some OT13 things. I collect OT13 for like Season's Greetings and like Carrot Kits, those kind of things that already come in a set. So I just keep those because I love them so much. Um, this is the Carrot 3rd Generation photo card set with my membership card. And then these are the Seasons Greetings of 2019 photo card set. Then we move into the Carrot 4th Generation kit. And soon I am going to be having the um, Seasons Greetings of 2020. Or, yeah, 2020. Wow, God. Oh my God. I'm aging. <laughs> and then I did... Um, Oh, that's my carrot card on the back. I did buy the Kino for the first time, like, ever. So I got the full set for an ode. So I set them up. So I set them up by member. So I have Sung Chul Jung Un. Jisoo Jun. Uh, Hoshi Wanu. Then Woozy. Then Ming Hao. Ming Yu. Sok Min. And then Sung Kwan, and then Vernon, and uh, Chan. So yeah, and then we have the little two group ones that I just kept there. And then we have, uh, finally I have both sets of the 17 karat postcards. So I have them kind of like this as well. Yeah, these sets, I don't know why they took so long for me to complete, but I'm really glad that I have them because they look really good together. And then finally, I have um, my Seasons Greetings postcards. I do want to get the other two unit postcards, but they're kind of difficult to find nowadays. But I have the group one and then the one with jong -un in it, so that was really exciting to pull. And that is it for my 17 binder from 2019. Finally, the last binder that we have to go through is my little One Us mini binder. So One Us don't have that many photo cards yet, so I decided to keep them in a little mini binder if you've seen my organization video on that. Um, but yeah, so this is what it looks like. If you haven't seen that video, I suggest you go watch it, <laughs> just saying. 
but um so in that video I said that I would be collecting three members of 1S I kind of lied that turned out to be really difficult and really expensive so I am collecting my top two members um which are Ponwung and Xion so I am so excited to be collecting them so these kind of videos they just like show exactly how your collection is at whenever point you film them I didn't have time to get his heart card before I filmed this video so that's kind of sad but I'll get it eventually and it gives me room to improve my collection so yes this is um, light us minus Juan Wung's um, heart card I know where to get it I just haven't bought it yet and this is just to display where my collection is from 2019 um, so I haven't gotten that yet but I'll get it soon once January hits probably and then we move on to raise us so I have that set completely complete so I have the dawn versions and the twilight version of the photo cards and then we have fly with us complete which is super exciting so I have I believe these are the white ones and these are the black photo cards and now we have the postcards from Raise Us. So we have both of Huan Wung's. And then both of Xion's. And then we only have one version of the group postcard from Fly With Us in the new year. I definitely want to get the other version and put it in here but that is my tiny one as collection gotta do it to them <laughs> um but anyway thank you guys so much that was my 2019 photo card binder tour i hope you guys liked seeing my collection in full um so definitely thank you guys so much again for 1k i am so thankful for you all um and i'm just so excited to see where this channel goes in 2020 and where my collection goes in 2020 so soon i am gonna be doing like kind of a part two to this video i'm gonna be going over my collection um like goals that i had for myself for 2019 see where i see what i did see what i didn't do and then list some of my collection goals for 2020 so i hope you guys are looking forward to that video anyway Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in that video whenever it pops up. So until then, I'll see you later. Bye guys.